Hi everyone, my name is Mathieu, so by uploading this video I'm proud to announce I'll be uploading a new series of videos more based on 3D printing and composites together. So this is about the Ender 5 Plus I bought, so I'll be making some videos about the enclosure I made for the 3D printer, so I have three now, uh, about silicon molding by using a 3d print about composites making finishing parts and many more so my focus will be a bit more on the 3d printings combined with composites because i think other people are very well at doing like videos about the settings and so on i'm just still learning about this phase so um, if you have some requests about uh, 3d printing like combined with composites or mold making or like making multiple costs out of one 3d print make sure to write these down in the comments below because this will be a series that will continue over the years while i'll find some new ways to include 3d printing into my workflow so mostly this will be about making cutting tools um, making like samples for um, the carbon fiber cutouts and many more so uh, this will be more of my focus on 3d printing on that so first of all I was a bit skeptical about buying 3, uh, 3d printer so it is this is my first 3d printer I went for the Ender 5 plus because it has a large build volume it's very easy to assemble like you can see in this video so this is like more an unboxing this is not a full assembly because you have other videos about that but this is more like to show you the way way on how easy it is to assemble this printer and get it ready for the first print straight out of the box so this was a very good experience for me so I bought the Ender 5 plus I'm not sponsored in any way by them so this is just my review about the printer I'm not saying this is the best printer but this is the best printer that works for me so for about 550 euros you can get this printer so this is in my opinion pretty cheap so I bought three of them now I have a fourth one uh, coming later on because mostly of time so a print like I've noticed 3d printing can take some time and I want to make some molds in multiple parts and assemble them like as fast as possible so about the assembly it's pretty straightforward um, and like you will see the first prints that came out came out really good so after a few um, videos that I watched online about leveling the bed and so on you get good prints good quality in my opinion so quality was less important for me um, I just want to build large parts so this is why I bought these printers I bought four of these uh, because I was I want to be consistent in the, um, the printing and the dimensions and the quality of the print so I'm still learning and you'll see this in future adventures on my youtube channel so if you like this make sure to subscribe make sure to subscribe for the next videos the next video will be about finishing 3d parts so I hope I'll see you in this video so thanks for watching and see you in the next one